So hi, my name is Michael and I'm 160 centimeters tall. And since I'm 29, I can do anything to become taller. But maybe I can fake my height, like wearing elevator shoes, or lie about my height. In fact, I'm 157. But I know that if I go to the gym, I can become thinner, I can become in better shape. So my height is a fixed trait, while my muscles can grow with training. And what about intelligence? Some people believe intelligence is a fixed trait. They have a fixed mindset. They want to appear intelligent, even cheating. They don't ask questions. They don't accept challenges. They ignore critics. Uh, other people have a growth mindset. They think uh, intelligence can grow. They want to grow their intelligence. They want to learn. So they ask questions, they accept challenges, they learn from critics. And um, growth mindset is a real advantage. Students with growth mindset get better results in math and science, and girls with growth mindset are less influenced by stereotypes. And in my discipline, computer science, there are a lot of stereotypes. Computer scientists are seen as nerdy, as social boys, often thought as geniuses. Uh, and you should not be surprised that after an introductory computer science uh, uh, course, uh, students move towards a more fixed mindset. But I think that uh, um, there are some characteristics of computer science uh, that can foster a growth mindset. For example, it is a very creative subject. You have to come up with uh, always create new creative solutions and leave the boring stuff to computers. Uh, you cannot automate error detection. So computer scientists get used uh, to find and solve errors all the time without being discouraged. And in general, the software development process is a continuous refinement of uh, your work. So, as computer science is going to become uh, a compulsory subject at all school levels in the next years, I am uh, developing teacher training materials and student materials to help them uh, uh, get the basis of computer science, that nowadays is sometimes called computational thinking, but also to help them uh, have a growth mindset with respect to computer science. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you.